Okay, welcome back to another Films and Figures Friday. And today, as you can see, we have got Marty McFly from the 1985 film Back to the Future. This figure um, came out a little while ago, a year or so, maybe two, from Present Toys. Um, a lot of people... And put down the head sculpt saying it wasn't very uh, accurate it looked more like Eric's, Eric Stoltz who did um, was originally cast for the role of Marty um, I think it's a good likeness to Michael J Fox who uh, later took on the role and you know made it his own Great film, great cast, Leah Thompson, Crispin Glover, um, can't remember the bloody doc's name, Christopher Lloyd, and of course Michael J. Fox playing Marty, um, can't remember Biff's name, but yeah, he was good in it. I hate my door. <laughs> so yeah, this figure came out a couple of years ago. I forgot to show you the tape. There's the tape. Classic film. It, of course, it had three parts, and uh, no doubt they would like to remake this film, but apparently they can't because, it, <laughs> thank God, because it's written into the contracts that I think the actors have to pass away before they can remake it or something. Saw something on YouTube short. But yeah, this figure that come out uh, from Present Toys, it come, as you can see, with everything that you see here, except the camcorder, which is a Hot Toys camcorder, which I picked up um, loose, which was uh, lucky. It's got great detail on the camcorder. Uh, it hasn't got all the decals because uh, of licensing, same with the skateboard. Even though this was from an unlicensed figure, they could have put the decals in there, but they didn't. And uh, to avoid copyright, they called it the figure through the boy. <laughs> when it's quite clear, it's um, Mar Marty McLarge for us. <laughs> so, yeah. Not a lot more to say about it. I mean, the quality on this, um, the clothing on this is excellent. It's on a par with Hot Toys. Um, I did have the Hot Toys one, uh, the 2.0 Marty, and I did do a little comparison. I sold that one on because uh, I did like things about it, like the head sculpt and stuff. Um, but I just preferred this one, and for the for the money, it's just. This does me. It's it's a representation of Marty from the film. I like the head sculpt and expression more. Maybe it's not as accurate as the Hot Toys one, the 2.0. But I just felt the 2.0 with the dog and it just didn't do it for me. I just uh, I paid a little bit too much for it and I sold it for about the same price. And I, I probably could have kept hold of it for a few more years and it would have been worth double what I sold it for because that's how it goes with some Hot Toys releases like Ellen Ripley missed out on that one and then uh, that goes for four or five hundred stupid money never going to get that so present toys I know you're doing a 2.0 Ripley uh, from Aliens uh, not a 2.0 but a Ripley from Aliens from the second film so Hopefully that comes out soon and that looks good, looks okay. Um, hopefully they go back and do a um, Ripley from Alien. Because that is a figure I missed out on and one I'd love to have. I have a custom head sculpt waiting to go that I picked up from Pick, uh, Pick Chen, <laughs> Kit Chen years ago with rooted hair. And I think that would look amazing on... Uh, Ripley figure, but I say I missed out first time round. I had an opportunity of picking it up for 140 quid. 
140. And that goes for 500. Crazy. But this one, I don't know what this one's worth, to be honest. I'm not really bothered because I'm not selling it. This is a, a film that I have grew up with. I, I love. I, uh, I saw it on a ferry once going to Ireland in a little tiny rundown. <laughs> well, it's just a room basically with a projector and a, a pull down screen and school chairs, stackable school chairs it was no comfort at all but it was it was brilliant it was such a novel experience to watch this film which i'd seen before um on a ship <laughs> rolling around luckily I, I didn't get seasick and uh um yeah i'd love to see this film again in a cinema because i've never seen this in the cinema as such but yeah that's all for today I'm going to make like a tree and get out of here. And uh, thanks for uh, liking, sharing, subscribing, all that good shit. And uh, I'll be back soon with another Films and Figures Friday. Okay, take care. Bye-bye.